China has suffered three of the four deadliest earthquakes in recorded history. In 3,000 years, they recorded more than 2,000 quakes. These are the oldest seismological records on Earth. To the Chinese, an earthquake was not just a natural disaster. It was, in a sense, a deeply unnatural occurrence, a sign that something was profoundly wrong with the cosmos. The emperor was not ruling as he should. So for the emperor, it was very important to know when and where an earthquake had struck. In the second century AD, a new invention provided him that crucial information. It was a six-foot-wide bronze seismoscope, an ingenious device invented by mathematician and astronomer Cheng Hung. There were eight dragons, one for each principal point on a compass. Each dragon held a bronze ball in its mouth. When the earth shook, the dragon facing the direction of the quake dropped its ball into the mouth of the toad below, alerting the palace. No one is sure how the interior of the seismoscope worked, but most experts believe an inverted pendulum at the heart of the mechanism controlled the dragon's jaws. The vibration swung the pendulum in the direction of the quake, which then triggered the dragon's mouth to open and drop the ball. Earthquake prediction remains a very inexact science, but if we ever get it right, we may have the Chinese yet again to thank.